Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am sharing my thoughts with you on the 100% Pure Multivitamin PM Serum. Now this serum has a lot of reviews, uh, a lot of really, really good reviews and some sort of average ones. So I wanted to do a really intense, in-depth trial with the product, um, which I did do over the last month or so. It's good to keep in mind with skincare products, it can take, you know, four to six weeks to start seeing results because your skin only renews every now and then. It's it's not going to give you results within a day or a week. So if you are trying a new product, I would recommend giving it a good month to six weeks um, before you make a judgment on whether it's working or not. So before I jump into my experience and my review, I wanted to just go over some of the main active ingredients with you, give you some more info on them, what they're supposed to do, um, and also some warnings as well because this is quite a potent serum. Now this is a serum, but they also have a night cream in this range as well. I haven't tried the night cream, but you can get packs of both or you can buy them individually. And this is not cheap, but I don't think it's really that expensive either. Um, you're looking at around 60 Australian dollars for this serum. So I'll leave links to everything down below for you. Let's start off with looking at some of the active ingredients. So it does have vitamin C. Uh, we all know vitamin C is good for our body and our skin. It can help brighten, it can help protect the skin, and it boosts collagen as well. So vitamin C is fantastic. This contains 10% vitamin C. This also contains 10% vitamin E, which helps to restore and protect from environmental damage as well. So that works really well with the vitamin C. Uh, a couple of ingredients here that you may not know a lot about, so I want to share some info with you. The first one is it's got 1% retinol, which is a vitamin A. So retinol is quite effective at uh, reducing fine lines, wrinkles, and it can also assist with reversing any sun damage that you might have as well, so pigmentation, etc. So if you haven't used retinol or vitamin A before, it is recommended that you introduce it slowly into your routine, using it two to three times a week initially, and then building it up to a daily amount. The reason for that is, if you have really sensitive skin or you haven't used vitamin A or retinol before, it can make you peel, can make your skin quite dry and irritated. A lot of products aimed at targeting acne uh, contain vitamin A or a retinol. So it kind of is constantly renewing the skin and peeling those dead skin cells back and leaving you with fresh skin. But through that process, it can really irritate your skin in the initial stages. If you are pregnant, it is advisable that you do not use products containing vitamin A or retinol uh, because it could possibly have an effect on the baby. So that is a really effective ingredient, but I just wanted to explain a little bit more um, in detail in case you weren't aware of some of the potential side effects. So I would recommend with a product like this that you do patch test and you implement it a few times a week if you have not been exposed to vitamin A or retinol before. Other ingredient that's interesting, which I didn't really know a lot about until I did some research recently, is COQ10. So one of its main functions is to produce energy within your cells, helping them to act as an anti antioxidant and protecting your cells from external damages. Another thing to quickly note is you should only use this product at night because it contains the vitamin A or the retinol can make you more sensitive to sun. When you're using something like this, use it at night only and make sure you are wearing a lot of sun protection while you're using these type of products. So in addition to those active ingredients, it also has some really good skin loving, nourishing ingredients, rose water, rose hip oil, and sea buckthorn oil to give you that hydration and give you that brightness and glow. So it is a good counterbalance when you've got the vitamin A or the retinol, which can be quite drying and irritating. You've got some really good nourishing ingredients in there to help balance that out. So they're kind of the main ingredients I wanted to talk to you about. I will leave links to everything down below and you can do your own research and see if there's ingredients in there um, that are of 
further interest to you or that you would rather avoid. But otherwise, I'm going to jump straight into my review now and my experience over the past month or so. So I applied this for four weeks straight every night after cleansing. So as soon as I got out of the shower or washed my face, this was the next step for me. And you only need one pump. It goes quite a long way. It's nice and soft and silky and it smells amazing. It smells citrusy um, or fruity and I really enjoyed applying it. It feels really nice on the skin. Um, but I found that it is a serum. It's not a moisturizer or an oil. So I would highly recommend applying either a night cream or dabbing on some oil after this has um, taken a moment to settle into the skin. It's just not quite enough hydration at night. It absorbs into the skin really quickly and I found immediately it did give me calmness and brightness straight away. Like as soon as I applied it and it had settled into my skin, it just made my skin look and feel so healthy straight away. So the only thing I found that was a little bit annoying with this is the pump bottle. I'm not sure if it's just the one that I got or what the goal is, but um, I found that when I push the pump down, instead of just coming out in like, you know, a blob of product, it would like splatter everywhere. So I did find that a little bit irritating, but that's just being really picky. Um, by the way, this is a 30 ml bottle and this is what the bottle looks like. Now I'm going to insert some pictures here and it is really hard to get the exact same lighting and angle over a four week period, but I did my best. I'll let you be the judge um, of these images, one, two, three, four weeks. But personally, I found after probably the three week mark, I started to notice quite a difference in the brightness of my skin, but also my pigmentation. I don't have a lot of freckles or pigmentation, but they are there. But I found I did have um, quite a lot that had built up over summer up here um, and even just around here as well. And I noticed after week three, there was quite a difference uh, with the tone of my skin and also how dark those spots were as well. I found they had reduced quite a lot. All of the images were taken in natural light with the same camera in front of the same window, but they may be just slightly different with the lighting. So I do apologize, but I hope that you can notice the difference in the images. I will let you be the judge. I am definitely happy to recommend this product based on my results. And I think it's worth a try. If you are mature, you have mature skin, you want to try to reverse some of the damage you've done. And even if you're not, if you are in your mid to late 20s and you're wanting to use some preventative skincare, then this is probably a, a good product for that as well. Otherwise, I am happy to recommend this product. And I also have a blog post that will be going live at the time this video goes up. So if you like to go and kind of read in a bit more detail about some of the ingredients in this and have a look at the images in more detail, I do have the images in the blog post as well. So I'll leave links to everything down below. And if you do have any requests for me on any other skincare products that you would like me to try, or any makeup products, let me know. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching and for your patience. I know I have been off social media and off YouTube for the last few weeks. I have been sick and you can probably hear it in my voice. I do not sound like my normal self, but I am back in the game and I have some more amazing content coming to you shortly. So thank you as always for your support and I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.